Hello and welcome back to Conspiracy Theory Review. Please like, comment, subscribe, share, and hit that notification bell to support the channel. The U.S. Department of Defense's DOD, Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, DARPA, in Arlington, Virginia, that performs research and development on a range of specialty projects. They've been credited, or accused, of creating everything from the Internet, Siri, and the Global Positioning System, to Arc Light, XS-1 spacecraft, and brain-computer interface. These are just the projects of which we know. The Information Processing Techniques Office is a secret squirrel department of DARPA that developed LifeLog. DARPA LifeLog was a project unlike any other. It was ambitious, innovative, and controversial all at the same time. The goal was to be able to trace the threads of an individual's life in terms of events, states, and relationships, with the ability to take in all of a subject's experience, from phone numbers dialed and email messages viewed to every breath taken, step made, and place gone, creating a comprehensive digital record of every aspect of an individual's entire life, from birth to death, Using a combination of digital technologies and data collection methods sounds simple enough. The idea was to capture every moment, every interaction, every thought, and every experience in real time, creating a digital archive that could be accessed and analyzed at any time. To be absolutely clear, this means every conversation, every interaction, every thought and emotion, credit card purchases, websites visited, books and magazines read, the content of telephone calls, emails sent and received, scans of faxes and postal mail sent and received, instant messages sent and received, books and magazines read, television and radio selections, biomedical data captured through wearable sensors, physical location recorded via wearable GPS sensors, all stored in a massive database sounds very Orwellian. The project was launched in 2003 with the aim of developing new technologies for intelligence gathering and analysis. The concept was simple yet groundbreaking, to create a digital diary of a person's life that would provide valuable insights into their behavior, preferences, and relationships. The potential applications of such a system were vast, ranging from personalized marketing and health care to national security and law enforcement. But as with any ambitious project, DARPA LifeLog faced its fair share of challenges and controversies. Privacy advocates raised concerns about the implications of collecting and storing such vast amounts of personal data, warning of the potential for abuse and misuse. Critics argued that the project represented a dangerous intrusion into the private lives of individuals, blurring the line between surveillance and personal freedom. Despite these concerns, DARPA LifeLog continued to make progress, developing new technologies and data collection methods to capture every aspect of a person's life. From GPS tracking and social media monitoring to wearable cameras and biometric sensors, the project utilized a wide range of tools and techniques to create a comprehensive record of an individual's daily activities. As the project evolved, researchers began to explore the potential applications of the data collected by DARPA LifeLog. They discovered that the digital archive could be used to predict behavior, identify patterns, and even detect early signs of illness or mental health issues. The possibilities seemed endless, with the potential to revolutionize everything from personalized medicine to national security. As the project neared completion, DARPA LifeLog faced its biggest challenge yet. In 2004, Facebook was launched, transforming the way people shared and documented their lives online. Suddenly, the idea of creating a digital diary seemed outdated and unnecessary, as millions of people around the world were already doing it themselves on social media. In the face of this new reality, DARPA LifeLog was quietly shut down in 2004, its ambitious goals left unfulfilled. The project had been ahead of its time, a visionary concept that ultimately fell victim to the rapid pace of technological change. But its legacy lived on, inspiring new generations of researchers and innovators to push the boundaries of what was possible in the digital age. 
And so DARPA Life Log became a cautionary tale, a reminder of the risks and rewards of pushing the limits of technology. It was a project that dared to imagine a world where every moment of our lives could be captured and analyzed, for better or for worse. While it may have ultimately failed to achieve its goals, it left behind a legacy of innovation and inspiration that would continue to shape the future for years to come. Think about this as you go about your daily lives with your smartphone in your pocket, smartwatch on your wrist, posting your every move on Facebook, and using Google Maps to guide your travels. As evil as LifeLog sounds, we now do it willingly without a single reservation. Thank you for your support. Please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more fun conspiracy content. What other conspiracy theories would you like to see? What?